We got this one good. What the what the crap? Um welcome back to Interoska, everybody. Interostra, everybody. I keep pronouncing the name wrong. We just got to the hangar in the last episode. And I'm looking around, I'm really excited, but I just realized we didn't scan or look around this area outside, so I don't want to miss anything, so let's check uh, out here. Now this is a new survival space game, a space survival game. So you're picking up, you know, food, you're picking up water, all that kind of stuff. You have to worry about your heat and uh, your health, so you don't want to fall down and die. And, you know, I'm trying to pick up stuff like, oh god, like over here. Let's go over here. There are puzzles as well. I'm loving this so far. The feel of it is really good. The idea behind it is really, really, really good. It definitely needs a little bit of polish, but it's in early access. You guys can go find it on Steam right now if you want to. I don't think it's anywhere else yet, but early access on Steam if you got it. Oh, wait, we can buy We can get a whole bunch of this stuff. All right. So we have our uh, gathering gun to gather our stuff. It's like a multi-tool in No Man's Sky. So, oh, wait a minute. There's this thing over here. Let's scan this thing. We scan these little wrecks in order to uh, unlock stuff. Oh, we just unlocked a helmet. Okay, good. We can also, if you right-click on your mouse, you can scan for all kinds of stuff. So let's scan for all. Scan everything. Let's see. It'll mark everything for us. Okay, so yeah, there's a lot of titanium here. I'm guessing we need titanium to make a... Uh, to make materials like our suit and stuff like that. All right, let's gather some stuff here. And I do like the fact that you have a gathering gun and stuff like that, but I wish it was more like Mo in No Man's Sky where it was mostly all on the same tool and you can just get upgrades to put on your tool. That way you don't have to keep changing tools. I can just, you know, flip it to a different mo excuse me, mode. But hey, you know what? It's actually really interesting. I like it. I can't wait to do, uh, make all this cool stuff. Well, let's scan again. Let's move back to scan. All right, I think we did all of that stuff. Give me that. I don't even know what we're going to need titanium. The other thing is, there is no weight limit in your inventory. There might be a space limit. Like, there's only so much room in your inventory. But, let's go to the inventory. Let me show you what the inventory looks like. Your inventory is pretty, pretty big. Look at that. Pretty big. So I'm not really- I'm not too worried about, uh, inventory space. There's no, you know, there's no, like, uh, weight limit or anything like that. So, you know, you don't- you don't have to worry about, oh, I picked up too much of this heavy item. That's pretty interesting. I like that idea. We did all this. Alright, let's go down here. Oh, this green thing. What is this green thing? Can we grab that? I also, I want to uh, grab and uh, make anything we can before we leave, because we're about to take off. We can uh, make a ship and get the heck out of here, so I want to make sure I have all the equipment I need. Green thing, what is this? Nothing? Okay, nothing on that green thing. There is this thing, though. Scan this. Let's scan again. Let's see if there's anything around here that we need. Oh, there is some stuff. Like, oh, we have our, uh, lead. So I'm guessing there's some basic building components. Now, it's going to be interesting. I don't know if these are on every single planet. Like, if you always find lead. Because it is, again, early access. You can let them know, you know, they need variety and stuff like that. But early access means it's not finished yet. So they have plenty more to do and add to it. Oh, wait. We didn't gather all of it. Oh, we almost left that half done. I hate doing that. Like in No Man's Sky, I always get both. Or maybe it's regrowing. I did notice in the last episode that materials seem to come back real quick. So, that's a bonus, I guess. You know, I like it. But some people might think it's too easy if everything keeps coming back really, really fast. Well, then we can go back to our workbench. Let's go back to- actually, we, we had a workbench up there, right? At our, uh, launch pad? So let's go back to the workbench, because then we can, uh, we can make some food, because you need to keep your uh, hunger and your thirst, uh, up. You need to keep those meters up. But also, we can make some stuff that we just got. We just got a, uh, oh god. Oh! Damage! So I took some damage on that. I might need to use my medkit for that. That's the first time I've had to use a medkit. 
Okay, the, the jumping in this game is very, very different. God. Yeah, see? It's just, it's very weird. Very, very contextual. If you're next to a, uh, an edge of a, a cliff or something, you cannot jump. It won't let you. I don't know why. You, like, you can't clamber down it or on it. Damn. Come on. All right. Jumping definitely needs to be uh, improved, in my opinion. I don't know about you guys, but this jumping just doesn't feel like it should. Let's jump from here. Maybe we can. Oh, nope, we can't. Great. I'm going to die, so I need to use my med kit. So let's do that real quick. Put that down in here. In the hot bar, because I think we need to actually use it. Okay, there you go. Go, go, go. Done, done. Are you j okay? You know what? We're not gonna go to that one because uh, I'm tired of falling off that damn mushroom. One more time, one more time, because there is a box up here. So, come on, just let me get over there. Thank you. I thought it was gonna stop there for a second. Good lord. Yeah. yeah see, up oh, there you go. Hit an edge. Couldn't do anything. Had to back up a little bit. Yeah. See, like I'm not crouching or anything, but if you're on an edge, you can't jump. Why? Why? <laughs> this definitely, you know, early access. Early access. Got to keep reminding myself. Early access. Don't judge it too hard. Come on. Okay. Yeah, I forgot. I remember this from the the other episode. Okay. Yeah, you can't get too close to an edge. Messes everything up. Got it. Oh yeah, we have our drill, and we also have batteries. Everything's battery. Well, everything except for our gathering gun. Is battery operated? So let's see what we can make here. Let's do our add-ons. Let's see what that is. Oh, nanobots. Can we make that? Oh, we can. Lead and plant material. Let's create that. What do they do? Oh, done. All right, so that's a one and done deal. Okay. We can make a helmet, oxygen tank, suit. All right, but we need uh, plating, and you need to have uh, titanium and lead. Of course, that's why they gave us titanium and lead down there. So we need uh, plating. We need a lot more plating. A lot more plating. We need a ton of plating. Oh, we need mechanical parts as well. And optical parts. Let's see if I click it. Oh, it does make it. Okay. So it's intuitive. If you click it in the, the build, it'll actually do it for you. So it'll bring you to the, the uh, part you need. There we go. Oh, we need one more. Let's make one. Oxygen tank, we need mechanical parts. We need three of them, so let's do three. All right, so we have our helmet. We can make it. Oh, we need more iron ore, though. Um, We need iron ore for this as well. Oh, man, what? Wait, can we, can we actually make it? Let's see. Oh, okay, you don't need the bottom piece. The bottom piece is what you need to make the other thing. Okay, so we just need these. Okay, we just need those, so done. Create the helmet. Boots. We need plating. Oh, we do need iron ore for them, though. And, okay, yeah, we need to make some plating, though. We need to make a lot more plating. So, oh, we're going to take up all of our iron or uh, titanium ore to do that. All right. We need iron ore and iron ore, but we have all our plating, I think. Yeah, we're good on plating. Oh, we might need more plating. All right. We need to go get some more materials, so I will be right back. All right, you guys, I think I've gotten everything I need. So let's come back over here and craft the rest of our stuff. We're going to go to our gear, our suit. We have everything we need here. We'll create the one. Yes, we have our good suit now. Then we have our boots. Oh, we still need one more plating, but we have enough titanium and uh, lead, so we should be able to make that. No problem. I like how that's really quick. All right, let's make another one. Let's make the shoes. Okay, so do we have any upgrades? No. We have add-ons. We've made that. Tools. We've made... We have a scanning tool, power cell, hand drill. Okay. Components. We have all this stuff. We don't need to make it anymore. Can, oh, consumables. First aid kit requires water, plant, and food. It'll give you 20% health. So let's make two of those. And then I remember from the first episode, you guys... The food ration gives you both food and water, but the water bottle only gives you water. So that's why we're going to waste, we're going to use it all on food rations. So let's make as many as we can food ration lines. That way we can replenish all of our, uh, 
hunger and thirst at the same time. So easy peasy on that. Ooh, man, that takes a while to make. I wonder if it's depending on the number or the item. So like if you make something more complicated, it takes longer or if it's just however many you make. Like nine. All right. I think we're good, right? Yep, we're good. So then we have our, our gear station. So let's put on our gear. So let's equip our oxygen tank, our helmet, our suit, and our boots. So... Okay, yeah, that does actually affect our stats. Okay. So low temperature resistance and high temperature resistance. So it adds more resistance to our stuff. Got it. All right. So now we need to make that ship and get the heck out of here. Looks like the last target is still in the logs. I've highlighted the planets we're able to reach with available supplies. Okay. Highlighted the planets we're able to reach. Um, let's go to the, this one. This one looks like it's hotter, right? Oh, yeah, it looks like it's going to be hotter and has copper. Okay, so it tells you what you have before you get there. It's a high temperature zone, though. So let's travel there. I have created an interface to interact with oh. existing software. Use the available parts to create a valid rocket. I will run simulations and update in real time to give you information if your design will be able to reach the destination. Okay, so we have to add parts to it. So we have... I'm guessing... Mm, can I... Oh, it auto-clicks, okay. Wait, wait, yeah, see, it tells you where it goes. Boom. What else we got? A fuel tank. There we go. So we, we're making a fuel tank on top. So it's a double rocket, it looks like. Okay. Command module. Nose. Oh, that's easy enough. Now we need wings, right? No? Oh, we don't have wings? Dude. Oh, there are wings, but we can't make them. Oh, we don't have them. Okay. Okay. I think we're good. Oh, wait a minute. Escape, 205 out of 200. We're good. Maneuver, 201 out of 150. We're good. Entry, 231 out of 200. Yes. And thermal protection, 2,000 out of 15. So we only need the stuff on the right, but we have more than that. So we should be okay. I'm going to click this. Okay. That was... <laughs> okay. That was a loading screen. It just flew us there. All right. Oh, yeah. And it's a hot planet. Oh, this is like Mars. So, yeah. Leave the planet using the console inside the hangar. Okay, we did that. Come on, objective. Update. Point of interest. Okay, we got a whole bunch of stuff up north. What do we got going on here? Let's go. 300. 200. 700. Oh, good lord. Some of this stuff is way far away. Okay, so 200. This is the closest thing to me. I think my temperature is okay. Because I did put my new suit on, but... Oh, man. We'll, fi we'll find out. I think that running is probably bad, too. Oh, yeah. We should probably pull out our scanner. Duh. Now, let's see. Can we scan everything? Let's see if there's anything around here. Nothing. I don't see anything. Okay. We have some stuff around here. 125. Let's go to this point of interest. Okay. What is this? Distance. Oh, it's right there. Now it marks it. Okay. When you get within like 50 meters, it marks it for you. Water! We just use it? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, just nothing like drinking Martian water. Okay. Oh, and then there's a thing over here. Can we scan this? A uh, blueprint for another suit. Oh, okay. So I'm guessing you get a hot suit and like a cold suit or I don't know. I, I think we have a normal suit on. Okay. So we have our water. My health looks like it's orange. Give me a second, guys. I want to make sure my health is good. There we go. Do we do it again? Green. There you go. That's what you want to see. Green. 
I want to make sure it's all good and healthy and put my food down here just in case I need it. Keep it in the hot bar. All right, so we have... Oh, I'm stuck on a rock. That is definitely something they have to fix fast. Because if there's a lot of jumping in this game, you don't want the jumping to be bad. 800. 500. And... I'm guessing this is close. 200. Okay, yeah, 200. Something else over here. Oh, my temperature is rising. You see that bottom left-hand side of the screen? I am rising, so... I might need to get back and uh, put on my, my suit. Actually, I might need to... All right, we're going to do this. Hopefully, there's fruit here, right? All right, do it. Pick it up. Momoto fruit. Is this a fruit? No, nothing. Okay. So we got to get over here to the point of interest. What is that? There's something on the ground. Is that copper? Emerald. Okay. Everything is two. Okay, so you, you can get two out of everything. Okay. Up oh, over there. I might need to get in a cave or something because it looks like I'm get, I'm overheating. I'm already at 38 degrees. Get in the shade. 38.8. Up 38.9. Come on, I'm in the shade. Doesn't this count? All right. Over there. 39. Oh, it's going up slowly. So I think your suits just stop it for a little while. Oh, there's something here. What is this? Oh, this is copper, right? Oh, no. Kripazinzi ore? I don't even know what that says. All right. Maybe running increases my heat, too, so maybe I shouldn't be running. Come on. Give it to me. No? No? Oh, there it is. I get close enough to it. Yeah, so maybe don't run. Overheat yourself. That's cop that's copper? Okay. It's a weird looking copper, but I'll take it, I guess. Right, we have a lot of stuff. I need to get to a uh, a thing to make a suit. So yeah, we need to get back to our... Oh wait, our thing's right here. What is this? Oh, it's another uh, thing? Testing chamber? Hopefully. It's cooler down here. Please be cooler down here. We're underground, right? It should be cooler. There you go. It's cooling down a little bit. 38. There we go. All right. So we have another test chamber, huh? Or a uh, ancient ruin, I'm guessing. That's what it is, ancient ruin. We're, we keep going down lower. What is this? Can I move it? Oh, I can. Okay. I'm guessing it's going to be the eye like the first one. Ooh. It makes it hard to do. Okay. <gasps> we almost got it. There we go. We got this one good. What the what the crap? Um, we have a gun? Oh yeah, we have we do have a gun, okay. That scared the crap out of me. Oh, it overheats like a regular weapon. Okay. Oh, God. We're going to die. We're going to die. Dude, that was quick. Load the last save. Oh, jeez. I didn't even save. Please tell me you auto-saved somewhere good. In the middle, middle of the desert? Oh, you're killing me. Auto-saved in the middle of the desert. Well, let's get over here to the uh, the thing, and then we can save it, because, good lord, the autosaves, you think that it would have autosaved me right in the middle of, uh, you know, walking through the uh, ruins or whatever, the ruin site, but I guess not. 
So we gotta make our own over there. Gather gun, gather our emeralds. Maybe we need to equip our, our hot protection. Oh, wait, that's, a, that's nothing in here. Maybe our, our upgraded suit will have more protection because that thing just took me out hard. We got this, though. We got this. Oh, there's a thing up there. Can I get up here? I can't. Can I scan it from here? No, it's too far away. Too far away. Dang it. I'm getting hot. I'm getting hot in here. I'm guessing that is like a helmet or something I need. How do I get over there? I'm going to burn up though before I get to it. So I need to go. Go, go, go. Give me some copper. I'm guessing I'm going to need copper for my, my uh, heat resistant suit. Really? There. All right, cooling off, cooling off now. All right, we're gonna make a uh, we're gonna make a save like right up here <laughs> before I do any of this stuff. That way, I don't lose any progress this time. Like I don't have to walk all the way back here again. Oh, it stayed open this time, huh? Is it was it open like this last time? I'm trying to look. Oh, no, no. There it is. There's the door. That's what I was looking for. All right. We're going to make a manual save real quick. Yes. Heck yeah. And hopefully you guys liked the video. If you did, hit that like button for me. And I will see you guys in the next one.